Hey everybody, I am Aru Tarkin, and this is Bleach Brave Souls. It's been a while since I've done any videos, and I don't know, frankly, I don't know if I'm going to continue doing videos on the channel or not, but for right now, I'm just doing random videos as I see fit and as I want to. So, I want to do Brave Souls today because I've been doing a lot with this game. I do not know what it is about this game. To be honest with you, I was never a big fan of Bleach, but I just love going through it. It's on Steam. I believe it's a free game, so if you like Bleach, I recommend giving it a try. Well, first thing, normally dropping into this, check on the orders. I've already completed a couple of these. Boom. Yep. Daily orders, weekly orders, free stuff. I gained a promotion, didn't even realize I gained a promotion to 8th seat. Interesting. Alright, and then gifts. You never know when you're gonna receive gifts. Make sure to always collect them all. My main team consists of Brave Souls, Baragon, Vundervice, and Grimjaw, the Halloween edition. Now, being, it is also on mobile, it's on iOS I know, might be on Android, not sure, but you go to shop, one of the main things about this game is how you get your characters, and it's one of those basic you draw your character type of ordeal, right now they are really doing a um, 10 free summonings every day, so, I highly recommend hopping on it as soon as possible to get your free ten, 10 free summoning. Because otherwise, they take a while to go through, unless you want to pay out your ass or something. Well, when I say pay out your ass, I don't mean a lot of money, but two, three dollars here kind of adds up. <laughs> nope, Orihime. All the Japanese voice actor, too. Toshiro, Chad, Kuryu, Ore no Hyorin Maru wa Hyosetsuke Saikyo. Toshiro, Yuri, Koi, Appa demo. Oh, Jinsai Yamamoto. Teki no teki wa mikata. Kyoto no riyu nanka. Sore de jubun yaro. Oh, Lisa. And Kisuke. Joshua. And now that I got all of them. There are different classes of summoning you can go through. Along with many different Brave Soul themed creatures. Creatures. People. Summoning. And also, every once in a while you get tokens. Then you withdraw. It's really up in the air how special these draws are or not. Why did you go? Kind of made toast and all right. Now the main purpose of the game is just to level up your characters and get them a lot stronger. There are strategies that you can use to, um, like, become the ultimate fighting team, but usually that involves using unique char specific characters and stuff like that, and I don't do that. I mostly just use what I like using. So to be perfectly honest, while Grimjaw is a fan favorite, I'm not much into him, believe it or not. Right now, though, I am trying to level this Grimshaw up to maximum. So, the way I do that, I actually have my own way of doing it. I virtually just go through a level that I've already been through hundreds and hundreds of times. But, getting the results that I need, like right now, I need very specific items. 
a very specific item can be found in this level, so that is why I am going through this level. There are two ways to play, and the two ways are manual and auto. Right now, I have it on auto. Taking it off on auto, I can move around manually, and let's the price. I can move around manually, attack, and aim manually as well. Now when I'm doing a harder mission that I need more of a delicate touch to, I'll control it myself. But for now, it's just auto, 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 lock on to either the nearest target or one of the, um, one of the most stronger and aggressive targets. Right now, I'm really gathering the item for the most part. I don't have the need to put a whole lot of things into it, so I mostly just do auto. And now for the boss battle. And that was simple enough. I have high level um, characters. And my health at that time was a high level character, so I didn't even look back a lot. XP gain, money gain, item gain. Gave a whole lot of what I need. Go back to the soul tree. You use these blue tickets up here if you can see my cursor, you can do it up here. That's how you actively go and do those missions. You have to spend those. I spent five because I wanted the maximum amount of stuff. And now, by paying the coin, I have made him a lot stronger. Oh, I'm all out of this gem, so I'm going to do exactly what I did again. Go through it. Really fast. Just to get what I need. Now, one of the reasons my team is set up the way it is is because, well, I like a ring car. I've never was much into the soul world, I don't know why, but I love the hollow and a rank card. So that's why my team is mostly a rank card. So really high level rank card type. So that's what I'm using, but of course, Baragon is my favorite because after all, he is the king. Alright, let's go ahead and activate a special. One of my special is very straightforward. That could be the event. Ooh, a new clear record. And I believe that I got everything I needed. At least I hope I did. Although I'm gonna have to go through all of that again. Nope. Got everything I needed. Fully updated that. Fully update that. Boom. All the way through. And now, the only thing left to do, I did not mean to go all the way out here, even though I did complete a couple of orders, and I should probably get through that. Boom. Ooh, battle crash. Let's go back in real quick, because I need to evolve the red jaw. Once they get to certain levels, in order to make them upgrade, you have to evolve them. the level six. Alright. Now I can level him up past his previous that. Alright, so in here there are a couple of fun little things you can do. 
for instance, I just showed you some of the missions to get items. If you are part of a guild, you can of course do guild missions. Which, I have created my own guild. If anybody is playing the game and interested in being part of a guild, I have a lot of openings. You are free to join the Ouroboros 13. And with guild, you have guild quest. I need a lot of members to help with the guild quest. Yes, 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 I know. Let's see. Are we constantly using Ichigo? Let's use Baragon, since Baragon is a tad stronger. You can use items and uh, accessories and link character to increase everything. I just don't, because I'm an idiot. Quests are unavailable while the guild can work over. Oh! Well, I can't show you what a tent looks like because they are not available right now. That is awkward. Alright, so... I can't show you a guild quest right now, but versus battles. Rankings are currently being calculated for versus battles. Well, this is a horrible time. Alright, no versus battles then. What about Arena? Let me get the Arena's unavailable because of Rain. Well. League ready, your opponent's awake. That... That kind of freaked me out a little bit. I wasn't expecting that. Just boom! League ready... Number 10? Really? Ah! I was not expecting that. Six to ten. Okay. Okay. I was not expecting that. Well, damn. Okay, let's go. Licenses? I don't know what licenses are. But apparently I claimed a whole bunch of them. Let's claim them. Boom. A whole bunch of things that I have no idea what they do, to be quite honest with you. Orders? I got two new orders, apparently. Let's collect them. Don't know what these things do a whole lot of, but I did it. I did the thing. Power you up. I can. How many times can I? Let's go ahead and... Aha! I did it. Boom. Alright. Then let's go ahead into the arena. Of course, I love using Baragon because he is the king. Especially the Brave Souls Edition Baragon because the Brave Souls Edition Baragon is just so cool looking. And also, his special attack is bomb. Okay, the arena is basically a scoring battle system and you are fighting NPC enemies as well as NPC representatives of other players. You have to wipe out more of their NPC players than the NPC, pl and then they have to wipe out your NPC players, and that's more or less the gist of how Arena works. So basically, go around and kill everything. But you have partners, so stay aware of that. I think this also uses the auto feature, even though I don't do the auto feature in Arena. I want to be in more control of what the hell I'm doing. Ah, uh, loading, loading, loading. I'm ready to go. This thing's been forever. The Christmas music is amazing, but it is looping. <laughs> and I hate that it's looping. Mm. Connection failed. I am having all sorts of good luck today. Very good luck today. Alright. Then I pop on out of there. Jump right back in it then. Come on. Boom. Let go. To try a different one. Searching for players. Almost. Almost. Give me a number six. Give me a number six. Boom. There we go. Now hopefully this one will go all the way through. And I just blank out halfway through the thing.
Khan of the Zompop Do. Well, Khan is deaf, technically a soul. If he technically a soul, shouldn't he have an inner world? And if he does have an inner world, doesn't that mean that he should, in theory, have a Zompop Toe beard if you give him a blank Zompop Toe? I mean, it's all speculation, but... <laughs> Can't help but think about that. But Yoruichi used to be a captain. Doesn't that mean Yoruichi is supposed to have a Zanpak Toe since captains are required to? I mean, of course, unless you beat the previous captain. Oh, here we go. Alright, looks like I'm facing it. Alright. I'll go this way. Ah, I didn't see the That's the arena. And then, of course, the last part is the quest, which there are many different quests. In this one, you can go for the actual timeline of all of each and stuff like that. And I do not know why it exited me all the way out here. But Chronicle Quest, sub What I'm really working on right now is the Epic Raid. Everybody want to watch me fail real quick? Let's go ahead and do this. A long drawn out fail. Uh, oh, that's right. Uh, no. Well, yeah. Change with booty. Let's go ahead and join the room. Now everybody can watch me fail some blind. Uh, 
I would burn it on a leave. I don't have bonus. Let me get out of here for a minute. Why? Because I like being somebody actually had a full power. Anyway. Boom. Boom. Join room. Uh. Let's do it. Alright. That's a whole lot of different characters. I've never seen dual ones before, that's interesting. Alright, ready, ready, ready. Now this one you can go auto in, I highly do not recommend going auto in this one. But more or less, there is a massive boss. And you need a lot of characters to defeat said boss. Yep, Amino Grande and Gillian class. Get out of here. Yo, you better go to the attack, or let you have to stay out of there with you. Gillian is a lot easier in bed than done. And if you hit the outside, you are paralyzed. Oh, now you activate. Yes, sir. Now you're gonna watch me fire in the attack on the right. Nope. Nope. That was good. That was not
And that's how I horribly failed. In any case, time to head back home. Well, this is my short recording. I hope everybody enjoyed it. I know I did. And perhaps I'll do another one where I can actually show off, like, the guild, the battle, and all the other intricacies of this thing when they are not offline. Anyway, I hope everybody enjoyed, and I'll see y'all in the next one. Bye-bye now.